and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Lulu Shen. Going to be playing all of the new Ionia support cards, not all of them, but some of them with um, Demacia because we know how good at Demacia is. So pairing Lulu in with a Shen at Demacia deck should be pretty sweet. Definitely right up my alley, the kinds of decks that I like to play. I really like playing um, challenger units and support units together and so this is right up my alley um, so yeah we're gonna try this out trying out a couple of things uh, as far as like I didn't want Shen to be my only four drops I just I only found room for one Laurent Chevalier there was you know I could go Grizzled Ranger also there wasn't anything perfect but I thought the Chevalier could be kind of nice with Lulu of growing Chevalier up to a 4-4 four four also and making more challengers for me Kind of the same. I don't. I only have one Lancer. I wanted more five drops, but I just didn't have room. <laughs> so we only just have one Lancer in here, even though I wanted more. Um, you know, the, we just don't have room for everything now. Like I wanted a Bright Steel formation that got cut. Um, you know, I wouldn't mind a third Young Witch, but that's that's a lot of twos with War Chefs and Bright Steel Protector already. Um, didn't have room for the other one mana card, Flower Child. Didn't have room for that. <clears throat> I'm playing Rangers Resolves. Not a card I would always play, but I think that this format looks to be a lot of cheap units and a lot of combat, which are some of the other stuff that Targon's bringing in, and I feel like having a spell like this that can um, be just really cheap and really effective of turning combat in your favor is um, something that could be really beneficial. So we're going to have two Rangers Resolves in here. Um, <clears throat> Swole Squirrel, I should be playing that instead of Chevalier, I guess. I think Swole, if you're playing Swole Squirrel, I think you have to be having stuff with like Elusive or Overwhelm, things like that. Like you got to build around Swole Squirrel and that's not really what this deck is. This deck is built around Challengers and the, um, and the support units to go along with them. Uh, let's see. And since since I'm playing the Rangers Resolves, I'm not going any of the three mana barrier. We're going all repost. Um, let's see. And then I did want to have one Relentless Pursuit. As y'all know, I'm not a fan of Relentless Pursuit too much. I think this is I think this is one reason why people don't win very much with Demacia is they play way too much Relentless Pursuit. I think this is a perfect one of though. I would not. I don't think I'd ever want to play more than one because you don't need to ever draw more than one. Like if you draw the one. And it's useful, great. If you don't draw it, also great, because you probably don't need it. Um, but the reason why I'd want to play Relentless Pursuit is Lulu does make Relentless Pursuit a lot better, of being able to support, get this, get make something a 4-4, four, four, be able to attack again, so maybe support something else, make that a 4-4, four, four, and now Lulu's also, like the other thing, still a 4-4. Four, four. Uh, being able to have, uh, being able to do these support things twice, I thought would be nice. Um, but didn't have room it ended up getting cut all right so that's lulu shen kind of some of the other cards that we're thinking about playing we're gonna go play five games over in ranked hopefully get a three two or better the other squirrel fuzzy caretaker it's an option for sure i think that just having as many challengers as possible is really important with those other four and five mana cards i wanted challengers I thought that was going to be something that we would need. All right, so I love Ranger's Resolve against Ezreal. Love that. Repost is expensive. Young Witch is good. It's good to have cheap units, but not really against an Ezreal deck. I don't think I want a one health unit. So I'm going to mulligan that, even though usually we'd be keeping a two drop. But I don't want to keep anything with just one health. I don't expect them to have one mana deal two damage, <laughs> you know, to be able to kill Caretaker. Ooh. The Chefs or the Protector? If they have Thermogenic Beam, it's better to play Protector. If they have a Blocker, it's probably still better to play Protector. Alright, probably just better to play Protector. It's, it's, yeah, it's kind of a last season deck, but we are adding in a new champion. Yeah, we still have the three single combats. 
Uh, still loving that card. <clears throat> Alright, so I'm not going to be playing the tracker. I want to play War Chefs, and I want to play Shen, and I want to have Rangers Resolve available. Please do not have thermogenic beam to kill Shen. Please do not have thermogenic beam to kill Shen. I'm always up for a round no, oh, that still stops my Shen from attacking. Honor guide me. Is this even worth it? The answer is yes. Um, if I attack with Caretaker, also... And Steady my hand. They block these two. Caretaker's too good. I don't want to trade Caretaker for Twisted Fate. Caretaker's too good. Like, especially with me having Stand United. And United and repose, like, yeah. <clears throat> Is blinding us all good in this deck? The world's a big place. There's Let's probably the better way. options for so two mana. Like I don't, I don't think it's better than any of the other two drops that we have. Um, because you know you don't get to support it. Like the scout isn't as valuable. The scout part of the card isn't as valuable because you don't get to support it. Her followers. Well, during the scout attack. Her oh, that hurts. I'm having another blocker besides the Ezreal. That hurts. That's two for Shen. Say your farewells. So seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So I can put him down to three. I mean, I, I can go for the win, but then if they have a mystic shot, I'm in a lot of trouble. I think we just go for that, force them to have mystic shot. Our wills align. Really hope they don't have Mystic Shot. Alright, good. Stand United GG yet again. Everything as it should be. Stand United's just always GG. <laughs> And that is why I did not attack with the Green Glade Caretaker and trade it off. Because the next turn, it was going to deal 11 damage to them and kill them. It's too good. Too good. Oh, you meant our opponent's deck was a was a last 
format deck. I gotcha. Alright, no thumbnail for the new Nightfall Nocturne deck, unfortunately. Oh, I would like to replace this hand, please. Give me a new one. That's a lot better. Um, so yeah, I only have like three images I can use. Let's just, I guess I'll just use this victory image, I guess. Okay, sorry. Turn one. Leona, Aurelian Soul. No one drop, please. Darn. Okay, let's see. There's nothing a good giggle can't fix. It. Woo! Look what I did! Please turn me back! Okay, put one there. There. Sorry, I'm just kind of finishing up couple little things for the upload of the Don't Nocturne deck right now. You. Even to the young bloods, we are nothing. <laughs> the young blood young bloods. Oh, good, good call there, Slightly Bent. Last turn, Mystic Shot would have resolved first. I did not really consider that, but you're right. Even if they would have had Mystic Shot, the Mystic Shot would have resolved first and taken out the, the barrier, and then the Static Shock would have dealt one damage. And so, you are correct. That would not have been enough. Good call. Trade our one drop for their four mana dragon. You fly on, cute little snowball. Yeah, you did it. Gotta be worried about different protection spells they could use, like the plus zero, plus two, or something like that. You know, anything safe to protect her. Um, if I let them block Lulu. All right, Lulu leveled up. Looks like we're in a good spot. Looks like we are in a good spot. Ideally, we start dropping Genevieve Elmhearts. Or there's a dragon. 
All right, so I'm gonna give. Hmm. How do I want to do this? So I'm planning on playing the help picks and then probably also repose. <laughs> Uh, but which two of the three do I want to save? Right, we can only save two of the three. Probably should be the Green Blade Caretaker more than the Young Witch. I guess I could play Stand United and save them both. do that. I guess that's better than Riposte. Nature blesses her followers. Nature blesses her followers. It's fixed. Alright, I like having this Rangers resolve too. That's a really nice one mana spell. Deck's looking pretty strong. GG. Good job, Lulu. Alright, two and O. Oh. Off to a great start. Let's see if we can keep it going against. Against. Ooh. Some Nightfall. Diana and Nocturne. Well, Stand United is awesome, but it is just an expensive spell, so I'm going to mulligan it. I kind of wish I'm not mulliganing it, though, right now, <laughs> with all these Caretakers. I don't think I've ever had Triple Caretaker before. This is going to be new. So we'll have... Caretaker on one, caretaker on two, caretaker on two, and then protector on three and make them all three twos. Maybe we get a Shen up in here. This this game's kind of crazy. What do you got to, Kit? Just hanging out. I am one with the land. So do I play Young Witch on turn two to attack support, give a plus one, plus zero, quick attack? No. These woods protect their own. We're just going to chill for a turn. Definitely wish I would have kept that stand united with triple Green Glade Caretaker now. Well, I'm glad I didn't play the Young Witch. Protege's not bad. Hey, new bloco, I'm doing good. How are you doing? Are superb. Mentor Bad of the, the Stones. My shield is yours. Nature blesses That's going to make a large Lunari Shade Stalker. Go, floaty crystals. What's up, Mamba Man? I am doing good. Mamba Man's another wonderful streamer. Our time. For those of y'all to check out for some more good Rune Tierra content. Four or five elusives not going to be as easy to deal with. Well, 
Let's go, Shan. One balance. All right, so <clears throat> Shen pumps up all these Green Glade Caretakers. That's nice with the Sketcher. Discarding a gem to get a Celestial card, that's nice. Good, glad to hear a new Loco. Pretty sure we go Rangers Resolve to save Caretaker. Hold still. Can I paint you? Maybe just pass, no elusive blocking. Not like that. It's still scary, of course, because it's four power right now. The gems could make it six power, and then obviously they have all the other things. Um, certainly scary as far as getting to 14. Is concerned. If they aren't able to get to 14, we're going to have a nice attack back. Oh, that Standy Knight is going to kill them. <laughs> I don't know much, but I know the Standy Knight gonna kill him. If we are able to, uh, if they play something pre-combat and we're able to play something pre-combat, I'm playing this Young Witch to be able to block the Shade Stalker. They play another Nightfall unit. Your favorite is Leona Vi. Okay, that's cool. I was actually thinking about doing Leona Vi. I, because I'm, I'm playing up next. I'm doing Leona with PNZ, and I decided not to go Vi. I kind of felt like Vi was, um, just similar, similar to like the other like good five mana cards, and I, I just have a couple of Rillian Souls at the top end, but. Why, hello there. No closer. Very nice. That's that's cool. Alright, well this isn't ideal. So we're dead to the 3-2. Man, that's that was a great um that Equinox. That was perfect. Would have loved to block the Shade Stalker, of course. I guess, well, we're not going to be dead to the 3-2 because they can't play the 3-2. Because we're going to be going straight to combat and killing them. Who does not know the name, yeah, never mind. We good. They dead. Stomping people with Draven Tarek. Ooh. That sounds pretty sweet. Alright, let's see. Wait, you pump up this thing. I can't really imagine they st they stay alive. I guess they could have had double of the Nightfall card that drains one. That's what they could have had. Because that's direct damage, fast speed. They could have had two of those and drain these two. Everything as it should be. That's right, Lulu Shen picking up another win. Everything as it should be. Green Glade Caretaker being awesome. I know, right? We had all three in our opening hand. We had two, and I mulliganed another card, and it was just the third Caretaker. It was crazy. Turn one Caretaker, turn two, double Caretaker. We top decked the Shen on turn four. That made things better. And my other card, my opening hand was triple Caretaker, and then uh, Blighted or Bright Steel Protector to give them Barrier. So that worked out pretty good. I guess against Leona 
Fiora single combat gonna be awesome, so we should probably keep that. But we need units. All right, that's a unit. I'll take it. I am one with the land. <laughs> yeah, right. That was a crazy opener. Bless the people and fear the heretics. Amuni, do you have a, a list you can link? Clad in shining sunlight. You're covered. Nature blesses her followers. Punish transgressors. It's gonna be really surprised them attacking with the soldier. Alright, it's a free attack with the shield breaker, because that's gonna get the minus four minus. Yeah, you know, it's gonna lose the four health anyway. Thanks, Mooney. I'll, yeah, I'll definitely check that out later. I may play that in the upcoming days. Or, you know, maybe I'll play that tomorrow. We'll play some more Tarek. Okay. We got a 3 3 over here. Um. So Ranger's Resolve is not going to get saved. Yeah, it's not going to save the Protégé. Um, so I could I could repost the Protégé and save it, and then have my Caretaker trade with their Protégé here. Or I could go Ranger's Resolve and then save these two, and then my Protégé dies. Like, keep both their Protégés. I don't know. Maybe that's not that good because now I don't have, you know, not, don't have another barrier for this caretaker. My ranger's resolve doesn't look as good. We'll see. Maybe that was not the correct decision. Okay. Now we talking. Lulu can pump up protege, heal it. We got the resolve for protection. Yeah. Now we talking. That was a good draw. Behold the divine power of the sun. Or they just have that. Ouch. Bask in the light's radiance. It was good just a second ago. I'm not playing Caretaker because I'm going to save two spell mana for the single combat to go along with Genevieve Elmhart. So far, we have supported our allies an entire zero times. To the face. Oh God. Stand and fight. All right, so I can either go ra Ranger Resolve or Single Combat. If they have their own Single Combat, that's just bad news for me. I'm gonna try Ranger's Resolve. Yeah. Okay, 
let's see. That plus one, plus zero quick attack would be important. Hope they don't just play Twisted Fate red card. Who does not know the name Laurent? Red Fate, hi Lulu. Hi Lulu. Aren't you a cute little smooth boy? Hi Lulu. <laughs> GGs. We four zero. Oh. Four and O, oh, Lulu Shen. This could be our first five O deck in ranked. We did go five and O, oh, of course, with the um, Celestial Dragons deck that we played. The very first deck we played, but ranked wasn't up yet, and so uh, those games were in normal. I'm gonna keep Shen and Protege. Those two are awesome. Cool. I was gonna say hopefully we find some cheaper stuff to go before it, but you know, like it looks like we're playing against another Demacia Ionia deck. Similar deck to ours, except for they have uh, they have Zed instead of Shen. Could keep Curvin with the support units. I am the blade in the darkness. Mm, I guess that makes Z a 4-3, doesn't it? Just gonna let them level up Z. Um, I, I played one Trundle deck. The, it's, the only deck that I haven't made so far was the Trundle deck I played yesterday. And it it did okay. It was Trundle Swain. It did okay. Um, it felt like it kind of lacked some, some late game power. I mean, besides Leviathan Swain, which is awesome. Besides that. Um, the King Koo. Watch over Ionia. Watch all you want. I don't like how we don't have any spells whatsoever, right? Like the Rangers Resolve, single combat, that kind of stuff. All pretty key to have access to, and we don't have any spells whatsoever. It must be done. Uh, let's. Let's see. <laughs> I guess we barrier. No, let's see. You grow the war chefs, which bear, which grows that, which grows, which barriers this. You just challenge that over there with your barrier. They have the single combat. In these in these games, being able to have the, those spells are just really important to help break serve. And didn't have any cheap spells here. That hurts. All right, Mooney, have have a great night at dinner. It's both our actions.
My plan is protege to go along with this. Strength and grace, beauty in the play. Mm. Break their spirits and their swords. Only the word is Shadows as deep as any weapon. All right, well, we'll have Genevieve Elmhart and hope Genevieve Elmhart pulls this one out for us. Triple Challenger. These woods belong to us. Good, not reposed. Okay. belong to us. Eat up, friend. Taste the glory. So that war shaft was definitely blocking my Shen. And so instead of pump pumping this thing up, I decided to pump up the Shen. Not too bad. They still do have a tracker. We meet again, old friend. We're not worse. We once were. Nocturne deck. Yeah, the Nocturne deck was pretty sweet. Uh, the problem with all right. So Elmhart's like my best card to play. One, but then two. The problem is, if they just have Young Witch, then I would just lose if I play Genevieve Elmhart. If they just randomly have Young Witch. So that's kind of a problem. I guess I can't stop them from killing me with Young Witch anyway, because they have Fleet Feather Tracker. Uh, the Young Witch, any you know, my elusive blocker, so I can't stop them. So if they have Young Witch, I just lose no matter what. Because of the tracker. Wow, that's rude. Nature blesses her followers. We each defend our brethren. All right, GGs. I was just gonna go straight to combat. Back with everything. I wasn't gonna do the um, the scout. All right, so didn't have any, didn't have any spells, and they had two, they had two single combats. We still won. Pretty impressive. Shen's just awesome. Shen's really underrated, just the size. And so that's that's the thing about our Demacia deck with Shen, with Genevieve Elmhart, um, with the proteges. They had a protege also, I suppose, but we were able to go larger than our opponent. And the Shen's just offering, you know, being a 3-5 they couldn't kill, also offering barriers to protect my challengers. Made their life pretty difficult protecting Zed. Um, I think that in the straight up match, I think Shen is, you know, kind of outclasses Zed in the, in the heads up battle. And I think that's what we saw there. All right, Lulu Shen, a nice 5-0 in ranked, our first ranked 5-0. You know, we had the normal 5-0 with the Celestial Dragons. Um, a lot of good stuff here, and as you all know, this is, as I talked about at the very beginning, this is up my alley, this is my kind of play style, um, definitely my kind of deck, and, uh, yeah, the Rangers Resolves were really good, I liked them quite a bit, nice one mana burst spell 
for protection. Um, so there we go. All right, that's Lulu Shen. Those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. Let me know what you think of uh, these kind of Lulu decks. If you got any other ideas for Lulu, let me know. Of course, we're just going to continue to keep playing all these different champions in so many ways. Other kind of decks you want to see on stream, always leave those comments um, there on YouTube also. All right, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.